Is everyone ready to kill some biceps? I'm going to do a total standing biceps workout and I'm gonna use the same weight throughout. Um, maybe in some other workouts we will do some pyramiding and things like that, but for now we're gonna stay with the same weight all the way through. What I'm lifting doesn't matter because you need to lift a weight that you can work with. So that's really important. We are gonna start with a bicep curl. You start with the weights, palms facing out, and keep your elbows tucked into your side. And let's start with slow one and one. We're going to do 10. Keep in control up and down. I even catch myself swinging sometimes. So you want to focus on that bicep muscle. I think that's four, five, and don't swing. Keep it in control. That's six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and 10. Next, we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna turn it to a hammer curl position. And you're gonna do 10. Again, rest as long as you need to. If you have to, pause. But we're gonna go ahead and go right into it now with 10. I like these because it works the top of your forearm as well as your bicep. This is two. And this is the movement, you know, this is the muscle that you use when you pick things up, like your laundry, your kids, so this is a very functional exercise because you use these muscles. I think that's four. It's hard to count and talk. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. nine, and 10. Let them rest for a minute. You can put your weights down if you need to. Next, we are going to do a reverse curl, which also works your forearms. I like these because they work the lower end of your bicep and your forearms, and um, you might need to use a lighter weight so you don't put stress on your joints, but you start with your hands facing out, and oops, it looks like I forgot my gloves. Anyway, let's go with one. They do flare out a little bit when you get to the top. Two, keep your elbows tucked in. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. I'm gonna set the weights down here for a minute and stretch out your arms. You can put them out, put your thumbs down and just kind of stretch them. Another good bicep stretch is to put your arm forward, bend your hand and put a little bit of pressure on it. Next, I'm gonna do something that they call 21s. It's a burner, so get ready. We're gonna do 21 reps in a row, but we're gonna go halfway up for seven and then from the halfway point to the top for seven, and then we're gonna do a full double, you know, top to bottom for seven. So if you're ready, double arm halfway up. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Stop there, all the way to the top and back to this point. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. All the way down. Are you ready? Seven full reps. Slow and controlled. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
six and seven. Put your weights down, stretch out your biceps, and then you can do that two more times. Uh, you've got to be feeling this because I am. It's a burner. Have a great day.